Louise here from Crazy Borgies. I hope you're all well and fine. I have you on a gooseneck stand, so if the camera wobbles a bit, then that is why. I do have a really annoying shadow, actually. There. I think that's got rid of it. Sort of. Or I could have just made it worse. Okay, right. Today's video, second video of the day. Today is now Monday the 12th of December so I did a, another video earlier on which was for VIP cross stitch and this one is an unboxing from FG Normal so huge huge thank you to FG Normal for gifting me these products free of charge so that I could do a video review for them okay um, so if you are new to my channel um, welcome and if you are returning welcome also and i hope you've all had a beautiful restful blessed peaceful weekend well as peaceful as it can get at this time of year because i don't think anybody's weekend is that peaceful okay so all the products i will list in the video description box along with any discount codes that i have which i don't think i have any for fg normal and I will also link to just their website so you can have a little window shop and have a look and maybe throw out some ideas to your loved ones as to what you'd like for Christmas. <laughs> OK, so if you are new to my channel, as I was saying, please like, subscribe, share, comment down below, follow me on TikTok and Instagram on Crazy Borgies Diamond Art and hit the little notification bell which will notify you of my future video uploads. Okay. I think I say that in my sleep now, you know. <laughs> I know my children hate you saying it. They really do. But, you know, it's part of doing YouTube. Okay, right. So, I can see I have one. I have two. And I have three to look at today. So huge thank you to FG Normal. I have done a lot, a lot of unboxings for them recently. So I'm always grateful. And you've always got to be grateful, haven't you? Because you never know what tomorrow will bring. Okay, so let's get started with the one that's in the padded envelope. Okay, so there's nothing in there. Let me just fold it back on itself, or roll it even. So this one has, well, it's a special shape because we've got those gorgeous gold domes, which were one of my favourite special shapes, along with some Aurora Borealis marquees in there the clear ones so we'll have a look at those in a minute comes with your standard tool kit which is your green boat your pink wax and your pink single placer pen now if you're new to diamond painting this is all you need don't get caught up in buying for the sake of buying um, it's very easy to do so when diamond painting because unless you really really like diamond painting it's pointless you can diamond paint just as well with one of these as what you can an expensive kit okay so um from time to time i even use these myself from time to time to be honest most of the time i do just post them off to Gemma, uh, um diamond painting with gems because she does spares ideas with them okay so check her channel out also okay so this one is just a small 30 by 30 and it is a partial and it's quite an old image i actually thought i had to double check that i didn't already have this in my stash and i really didn't and i really was convinced i did have it but definitely wasn't there so i don't know what's happened to it no, I think I, I must have ordered it and it just didn't was out of stock or something. So I know that if I'd have seen this before, I would have ordered it. 
So a partial, if you're new to diamond painting, is where you only diamond part, that diamond part, you only diamond paint certain parts of the picture. So not all of it gets diamond painted. Okay, only the areas that are have little symbols on and that are sticky. Okay. With some partials, they do tend to um, just spread the glue everywhere. But with most of them, to be fair, the glue just sort of stops on the area that it's supposed to be on. Now, as you can see, what I'm doing is trying to relax this canvas a little bit because it is got some deep folds going on here. But unfortunately, with with partials doing what i just did there with the folding it helps it a little bit but most of the time it really does nothing with a partial if i'm honest you know but it's habit more so than anything that i do do that now it will have to get um put underneath some heavy books and um maybe just just keep rolling it for a little bit hold it there and it's a soft pliable canvas it's not that tough to get it flat to be honest with you underneath some heavy um canvases should be fine okay there we go so this one as you can see, it's only diamond painted the little birdie and a few little bits of the background and the little birdhouse. But doesn't mean you have to just diamond paint what they say you diamond paint. If you have any left over and you want to put some more snowflakes in, go for it. You know, it's your project. You can personalise it or customise it any way you wish, please. OK, so print is nice and clear adhesive is fine it hasn't gone over onto the um, non diamond painted area we have two legends and we do have the crystal codes there as well hang on when it focus there so this i like to see one is one two is two three is three etc it makes life so much easier when the symbols on the bags are the same as those on the canvas and there is a cute little thumbnail and there's the item number along with the canvas size now it's important that most of the time if you're new to diamond painting that this canvas size is simply the actual canvas size it's not the diamond painting size Okay, so the diamond painting area is actually about 25 and a half centimetres by 25. And you, most of the time you always are going to lose a few centimetres around the edge because that's where they put the legends and the thumbnails and the item codes and all that stuff. Okay. So, and um, for the prices, I'm going to give you the prices at the end of the video, okay? But FD Normal are very budget friendly and the pricing is always very, very reasonable, okay? So, let's see, we have 10 different colours and special shapes on this one. So let's see what we've got. So it really wouldn't take long to do this one maybe just like an afternoon or something so we have a clear we have a pink bright pink actually no it's not pink what am i saying it's purple it looked pink for a second and then we have a dark dark purple that's a, what is that colour? It's a magenta, magenta colour, is it? Getting fancy here, magenta? I don't know. It's 
like a, a pinky. I'm just going to say bright pink, guys, at this point. That's a purple. But then saying that, it looks blue in certain colours as well. I don't know if it's my eyes. But some of the colours look different off camera than what they look through the camera. So that's a golden yellow. That's another pink. That's an orange. And that is a blue, deep blue marquee. And then we have a big old bag of the AB coated marquees as well. Now, AB coating, if you are new to the craft, it stands for Aurora Borealis. And it's simply an extra coating, an iridescent coating that they apply to the top of the diamond, which gives it a northern lights effect. As you can see, it in certain angles it looks purple it looks blue it looks all sorts of different colors and that is the ab coating doing that okay we have a large bright pink and we have some small gold domes as well okay so that should be a quick fun simple easy project to do in an afternoon, maybe sitting there drinking a nice cup of hot chocolate. Who knows? Who knows? Or coffee. I'm a coffee drinker, guys, to be honest. I love coffee, so... And trust me, with my children, I need coffee. Because without it, well, I just don't know where I'd be. <laughs> my life wouldn't be complete. Okay, right, let's move on to the next one. So let me just put this to one side and now we get number two out. So again, this is another partial and it is a 30 by 40 centimetre. Okay, a special shape as well and crystal rhinestones. So I'm not sure if we've got specials in here. We'll have a look in a minute. It might just be full crystal rhinestones, actually. Again, you get the standard kit, and this time you get these plastic tweezers. A word of warning, do not leave them lying around. Do not put them in your pocket. Do not um, put them in kids', kids reach because... They're very dangerous, they're very sharp, and my daughter, my eldest daughter, really hurt herself with these. So, and just because they're plastic, don't be fooled. They can be just as dangerous as the metal ones as well, okay? So just be careful. Word of warning there. So this one, as you can see, is two little gorgeous parrots sitting in a little cage, having a little snuggle time. Well, I hope they're having a snuggle time. They might be. They might be telling each other how much they hate each other. Who knows? <laughs> okay. So the canvas is very soft. Again, it's only diamond painted in the middle. So that is the only area that we are placing the drills or diamonds down. The adhesive is very, very, very good. Oh, there we go. Very good adhesive. And I like the fact that this one's on just a black background. And it will make it pop out that even more. So, as most of you know, I have a baby parrot called Rio. She is very loud very annoying and I have to say she's very demanding as well very demanding so but she doesn't look like one of these my one my Rio is more like Amazon colors because she's a pineapple cogne parrot and she looks colors of a pineapple basically so this one looks a little bit like her if it didn't have the blue on the top 
Okay, um, this one has 13 colours. We only have the one legend, which is up here. And we do have the crystal codes listed. And again, it's lovely to see that the... The same symbol on the on the bag is the same as on the canvas so that's excellent and it's a 30 by 40 but as I said it's that is just the overall canvas size not the diamond painting area size okay so I'm going to show you up close the print is a bit chaotic um, just because I think it's it's given off like a sparkle effect as well. Um, but it's clear. We do have some guide circles. So just be a little bit mindful of them. But overall, it's very cute. Very cute. And I think it's going to look absolutely gorgeous. Especially against that black background. Because that will just make it pop out even more. So there's the thumbnail. Let me just take this off. Whoops. Can you see it guys? There. That's the thumbnail. Very cute. Very cute. And the item number and the canvas size. So that is gorgeous. I do love partials just because they are a break from the full drills. Sometimes you just want to do something small and simple. Nothing too too demanding, you know. So there we go. Let's have a look at the drills. 13 colours on this one. Oh, one thing I never checked with the other one is we've always got to double check this canvas number matches up to the item number on the baggies. Because occasionally we will have these incidences where, well, humans make mistakes, don't they? So mistakes happen to everyone. That's all I'm saying. Okay, KA277 is the same as on there. So that is the right kit. And I didn't even check the other one. So I'm going to do that now quickly. MX. Let me just check this. MX170. Yes, it's the right. The right kit for the right painting. Okay. So... From what I can see, it is all crystal rhinestones, so no special shapes in this one. So we have a grassy green, a yellow, an orange, a red, another shade of green, a bag of a big bag of clear there, a blue. Soft baby pink, purple, a bright pink there, yeah, kind of like an ambery yellow there, a black, and then a brown. So Diamonds look really good. Doesn't appear to be a lot of trash at all in them. Okay. Lovely. Right. I'm going to move on to the last one now, guys. So, this I think is a fairly new one that's come out recently. I haven't seen it before. I could be wrong. But I think it is fairly new, if I'm honest. It is a bubble round. And it is a full drill. Standard kit, once again, with the deaf tweezers. 
and we do have a few special shapes in this one okay now if you're new to the craft the bubble round is something that we use to describe when the background is different sizes so this area back here as you can see the rhinestones are different sizes so it would give like a bubble effect okay right okay so it's nice and soft this canvas the folds are not deep at all in this one 30 by 40 let's have a look here we do have the crystal codes and wow there is a huge thick layer of adhesive there i'm not sure if the camera's picking up the uh the glue it has a real shimmer in the um in the canvas let me just do this nice this one shouldn't take long at all to flatten out and the canvas does have a nice shimmer in the background as well as in the glue there's lots of shiny shiny shimmer in it up and down over a bit that's a bit better can you see yeah so it is just a tree with a rainbow in the background and then just like the bubble effect in the background here and along the edge i think this one will be really nice to work on um let's see it has 15 colors on this one print is nice and clear and the symbols are all numerical and they're all corresponding nicely to the bag numbers as well so that's good as well as those crystal codes are there as well I don't keep my my uh crystals anymore i tend to send them off to gemma i only keep my special shapes that is the thumbnail i mean i think it is a fairly new image i haven't really seen many people unbox this one but i could be wrong there we go but isn't it beautiful i just it really struck me i i do have a passion for trees anyway i'm not quite sure why <laughs> i just love trees cherry blossoms are my favorite though so yes and then we've got this little bit in the middle here wonder what that's meant to represent but anyway so really nice clear image and this one the bubble rhinestones the bubble round rhinestone pictures do tend to work up pretty quickly to be honest because they are all different shapes and sizes so okay so it's coming in at 25 and a half centimeter by 35 and a half okay guys so again the item number, the, the sizing is just the overall canvas size. I don't know what is going on with with my uh, my stand this morning. It doesn't want to play. There, and that's as good as I'm going to get it, guys. I hope that's okay for you. Okay. So let's have a quick look at these. Uh, 
beautiful crystal rhinestones. Again, always double check. KA182 is correct, yeah. Okay. So. Okay. Let's have a bag of clear. Bag of purple, which I can see is trying to gate crash. Yes, he's trying to gate crash, isn't he, into the next bag. There. You stay over there, mister. You're not invited to that party. <laughs> Doesn't want to go. So we're going to have to be careful there because I can see he could quite easily spill over. So a bag of purple, bag of blue, light purple, baby pink, light blue again. Look, you can see they're trying to escape. A really dark green, a yellow, an orange, and the quality is wow, a very good quality, very shiny. A red, and then a bag of large yellow, and an orange. And then a bright pink, an orange, I'm not saying orange, a red, sorry, I've got orange on the brain. And then just a few little bright pink ones. Just trying to wonder where number 15 would go. Let's see. I do have a lot in my spares. From what I can see, 15 is only in this little area along here. But, there's only a handful. Will it be enough? Who knows? We'll have to wait and see, won't we? Number 14 is down here and up here. Okay. So number 12 is the orange here, that's number 11, okay, so we just have to wait and see, but I've got plenty of spares, and usually if you do run out and you give the company a little email, they will usually send you replacements, okay. Right, hold on one second. I'm going to hop off onto my email to find out the cost of these beautiful paintings. Hang on one second. Okay, guys, right, I have been on the FG Normal website, which is also linked in the video description of this video. And the prices are, as of today, the 12th of December, are as follows. So, for this partial 30 by 40 crystal rhinestone drill is £4.99p or pence even. And then for this partial birdhouse, cute little bird in a pink house is £4.99 also. And then for this gorgeous... Full drill, crystal rhinestone, special shaped uh, tree with the rainbow is £6.99p. Okay, and that's a good price for a special as well because they always tend to be a little bit more pricier than, um, than normal for some reason. So there's my little unboxing from FG Normal. So huge, huge thank you. To FG Normal, can't quite get it all in shot, that's it. Huge thank you to FG Normal and um, please like, subscribe, share, comment down below, follow me on TikTok and Instagram. 
on Crazy Borgie's Diamond Art and hit that little notification bell which will notify you of my future video uploads. And any questions, please feel free to drop me a comment and I will try my best to answer them as well as I can really. So um, I'm not an affiliate. I am just a hobbyist that likes showing different diamond paintings. So I'm not getting any um, payment from FG Normal whatsoever for showing you these products. And when I do complete them, I will do a second completion review video as well to let you know what I thought of the diamonds, the canvas, the adhesive, all of that good stuff. Okay. So take care. God bless. I hope that you all have a blessed remainder of your evening or or the rest of your day, wherever you are in the world. And let me know down below which one of these is your favourite. So um, I like to choose bright and colourful ones. I think my favourite, personally, would have to be the tree with the rainbow. Although mm, I do like that one as well. So it's between them two for sure. Okay, guys, you take care, God bless, and I will speak to you all soon. Bye for now. Bye.